man who's been canceled is on the internet. News at four. No, seriously though. This man, <laughs> he is an alpha male and he's fucking sexist and he's dangerous to women. And uh, he might be, I don't know, I don't give a fuck, I don't listen to him and nobody takes him seriously. But he does command an army of virgins out of the snap of his fingertips. He can Thanos you out of existence. If only the incels would leave their basements. Yes, I know the irony, there's me living in a basement, but I do have two kids, so I had sex at least twice. Oh wait, that's not all. Forget Thanksgiving with your mom. Is They're attacking me right now, or they were, because <laughs> when I posted the video like 12 hours before comments started rolling in, the best one was, He's out of jail already, you idiot! Yes, that is how the space-time continuum works. Thank you for implying that I did not need to, you know, explain it to you. Although, clearly you are having a little bit of a trouble with it. But that's okay, I expect you to struggle with, you know, why you're here in the first place. I get it. All of them, they were still denying it. They're like, that's not him, it's not him, it's a, it's a, it's a body double, it's a fake. It's the Romanian government trying to bring him down. I do believe the Romanian government has only ever tried to take Matilda down. That's a deep cut. Dude, Andrew Tate knows how to fucking find his community better than even Donald Trump does. Coming out on stage saying, I'm a man of the people, I'm a redneck. No, Andrew Tate literally has a company sponsored by Blue Chew Erection Helping Pills, or, uh, you know, Chew. And is a alpha male community that has an army of virgins. Literally every piece of his... Every piece of his Wikipedia page reads like an oxymoron. It's crazy. Outside of his house, there's a sign that says, You must be this tall to be a parent at this house. Otherwise, there is a ten grand entrance fee. Sometimes his wife, just to be petty, goes, Oh, forgot my keys. Damn. Cold. The one is still when he tried to call him out, like he was trying to act hard for his friends on the TV show, and he was like, I don't know her name. We've been together for like eight years, but she knows I love her. Y you know my name. Don't. Don't even. Yeah, she... She slowly wiped her yuvala. <laughs> yuvala. The one is still when he tried to call him out like he was trying to act hard for his friends on the TV show. And he was like, I don't know her name. We've been together for like eight years, but she knows I love her. Y you know my name. Don't use the fact that she's eight foot tall and he's about three foot four to lift up her skirt and Heisenberg say my name, goddammit, while wiping her clit on the forehead of him like Simba. Like, I swear to God, it was fucking G-checking the shit out of him. It's wonderful. Probably asking yourself, why am I doing this? It's because I want the views, damn it. Yo, come hate on me. I don't give a fuck. I could not care less. Usually I fucking answer every comment because it's usually people going, oh, he's got no teeth. Oh, he lives in a basement. Oh, he smokes meth. Ooh, good jokes. Original, too. These guys, they couldn't even fucking figure out the time space continuum. Why would I fucking respond? I mean, like, Jesus Christ. And plus, you could tell him coming from a mile away. It's like retard hard in a quar, like the fragrance. Mixed with a musk of My Little Pony beep jars that you would see on 4chan. And the strong stench of every parent everywhere associated. And their disappointment. Ugh. Poor parents. So literally, between that and the fact that it smells like they took the paint chips their kids used to eat. And they just tried to burn them for that smoky oak feel. And it just, you know, carcinogens. It's okay. It's not like it's gonna damage their brains any worse. Anyways, thank you for your love and your views. Bye-bye.